Hello there, everyone. Welcome to challenge mode. Because I'm just trying to prove a point to Oni. Oni's here. Right. Uh, and I am skeptical. I mean, I am too. So, <laughs> what? <we're laughs> so what? What the challenge is? Is uh, I beat Eve, tainted Eve, greedier mode. Without spawning these guys intentionally. So if I yeah. spawn it, I'll try and just re reabsorb it. Because there'll be times when I accidentally hold the button too Excuse me, too long. Uh, that's so. R. Nope. R. Nope, we're doing it my way. R. Yeah. Yeah, a little pokey stick's good, but it's kind of inconsistent when we actually get it. Wait, it's when did I get the knife? When when you had a horrible curse or whatever. I have two knives. No, that that's yeah, your little blood clot buddy has the knife. What? Move. Yeah, see, your little blood dude has it. Oh, I guess I accidentally spawned one. Okay, there we go. Yeah. Hey, you got a garbage pill. Yes, I did. Now, that's actually not bad. All right. Dr drowsy pills are good. What color was that? I didn't even notice. I don't know. But drowsy pills are super good for bullet hell bosses. So, yeah, we're going to do it my way. And Oni's gonna lose his friggin' mind because he's like, just hold R, that item's bad! Never! <laughs> Alright, good. That's my strategy. I don't hold R, I die. <laughs> uh, Curse yeah, of the see, Blind. I, I, I saved 10 seconds by not dealing with that. I mean, yeah. blood. Not even that it's bad, it's like one of the worst items you can get from the treasure room. Because, like, at least when they give you the uh, mom's key or the latch key or whatever, you have the potential to go into the gold room and find something useful to go with it. Yeah, I guess. Whereas this is just, here's every other tier is slightly stronger. Okay, cool. Yeah, but you know me. I also get the small range of... You've, you've seen how I play this game. Right, uh, that's fine. Let's Brute see. force. Brute force. That's exactly why I decided to pick up this challenge. Because who needs good items when you could brute force it? Also, I genuinely just hate holding R. I I thought about People doing it on this one. In less than 200 years. What? People who want to win a run in less than 200 years? Oh, that's me. Well, well, then that's why you hold on. Oh, I forgot that was the bomb one. Yeah. I literally had it charged. I just, I know that their color sometimes changes. And I literally forgot what color it was because I'm not uh, on the up and up memory wise. Now, I didn't say this is going to go well. You know what? No, I don't hold on. Why did I get flies? Um. That's a good question. Juice juice is good. That's a decent item, yeah. Tarot card is good for normal mode. I don't really like it in great mode as much. You just don't get cards. Yeah. I mean, unless you put money into it. But even then, you have that one show up at the shop. and It's kind of a big risk for relatively low reward. True. I mean, I stuck through that... Uh... Epic well, fetus it's a red slap card. fist. Yeah. Dr. Fetus. Yeah. Not slap fetus. But, yeah. Because I it just slapping the whole time. Oh, did I say epic fetus? Yes. Oh. Yeah, slap fetus. <coughs> well, at least that was interesting. Like, I mean, I... I try to put up with it as best I could because I don't quit runs once I get one going but 
I, I tend to restart anything that's just truly terrible. Like, it doesn't have to be the best item, but it's more I'm efficient. Sick of black lots. Like they're they're useless. It's definitely more efficient. I can't argue with that. But that is exactly what makes me quit games. Yeah. But even that, I only do it for like harder characters. It's, like you give me base Isaac or whatever. It's like, all right, I don't know. We'll get something good eventually, but I'm not going to suffer through you know, five or six waves of this. Yeah. Just to die anyways. At least give... Yeah, but there, there's there's a little bit of potential danger with that. Because I knew someone was like, why should I have to suffer through a run that's not OP? Ah, uh, just just do cheats. Stop stop playing this game. Yeah, at that point, you might as well just hack a good build in. And... You know, don't get me wrong, I want to do some... Uh, like, I basically always want to play as Guppy, because Guppy's just fun. But... Yeah, well, it's more fun because you don't get it every run, like. I don't know, I think even if I got it every run, I would still think it's fun because I just really, really like Guppy. Well, right, but... I, I'd like to see a Guppy character. Just give him, like, dirt what? cheap. Like, like, the lowest damage possible. Give him, like, one damage. Just let me start his Guppy. Like, hell yeah. That could be interesting, yeah. I was speaking of which, I forget what unlocks it, but there's another guppy item you haven't seen yet. Because one of the tainted characters can unlock an extra guppy piece. What's this one? That, I don't even oh, know that, that's just know. that's just Kane flying around. Also, yeah, I, I made the, the I made the same mistake. Uh, I don't. Like one day I'm in... Um. I need to kind of ingrain it in my brain. Uh, devil beggars suck in greed mode. Yeah, unless you're gonna like buy health immediately after using them, it's just not worth it, really. It's, it's just kind of hard to get the payout. Well, at least he's hitting the eight boot. It's all according to my plan. Also, uh, no, I would not normally do it this way. You know, for anyone watching who's like, why are you doing this? I'm just doing it to prove a point. Mostly because I didn't have anything planned, so doing it to prove a point is funny. I didn't know he could do non aids poop. One Only more right. Because you are a normal dingle. All right, chocolate milk. When? <laughs> yeah, you're kind of blind like it, anyways. I, don't know, I guess it would technically help. There would not be a run I would prefer chocolate milk on any more than this, in particular, yeah. because I'm specifically avoiding using. Uh, the clots. Right. Shouldn't you make the challenges once you're uh, good at the game? Ha <laughs> ha ha! You fool. I'm here to prove a point, not be good at the game. Yeah. Gloating is the best form of being good. Exactly. But yeah, I've beaten great gear mode with everybody, but four characters, and this is one of them. Slow and steady wins the race. I just do not have the patience. It's weird, I don't have the patience to deal with an enemy that takes 200 years, but I'll backtrack to you know, mid-max 10 cents or something. Like yeah, I just... It's like, well, we've got 90 cents, but, you know, what if we found money equals power? I really don't want to waste this three cents. I mean, I don't have the patience to do this either if it wasn't for the fact I'm just trying to 
mildly prove a point. Like, all it is is congratulations. You played the character literally as dumb as possible. Congratulations, you won. Yeah. It doesn't, uh... Yeah. You know what? I always check the exit room. Nah, no, you didn't check the exit room. Nah. There could have been a penny in the exit room. Right. Or health, but I mean... But now all the AIDS poop is still here. I don't think the AIDS poop despawns, does it? Uh, I thought it, it did when you left. If it was spawned by an enemy. It doesn't in normal mode. I thought it did if it was spawned by an enemy. Oh, you do a full heart? Oh, I thought they only did half. Oh, well. Yeah. I didn't say this episode's gonna be fun. I said it's a challenge. Oh, boy. Bone heart height. Um, no, everything's gross in here. Actually, this isn't gross. Freaky. But that is, well, yeah, me. yeah, that's not gross. Send me you don't step on the spikes there. Oh, free curse room. Is it free? Yeah, uh, you yeah. go and take a half, and then... Uh, it's not free-free, because free, you have to use one of your spare hearts, but, I mean, yeah, basically. You can get back to full easily. All right, yeah, give, give me the pointer. For, okay, you know what? I'll just take the pointer finger. I don't know why I was waiting to take it. No! No, my charge is on my insta-charge item! No! All right, now I get to... Wave yeah, that's, that's... Weird penis around. Yeah. Excellent. Or something. Still free. But now it's an amusing and kind of useless free. Yeah. All right, and this does shoot out a laser, right? Yeah. Oh, whoops. Uh, did not mean to have him spawned. Yeah. That's why yeah, I said it's not, I'm going to restart. It's I'm going to not actively use them. Yeah, that's fair. Especially since you started the battle. Yeah, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, finger is pretty good for this because it's spectral and piercing, so you can shoot through rocks and huge clumps of enemies and well. Just done a ton of damage, but it'll add up if you're trying to mow through a big wave of stuff. No. I did absorb it all right, yeah. Okay, we just took a full heart. That's fine. I am bone heart, buddy. Hello, Boneheart, my old friend. <laughs> it wouldn't make sense, but I kind of wish that the uh, the finger did da like very, very slight damage. Like contact damage with the finger yeah. itself. Yeah. yeah, that way I could just wait, waggle it around. Oop! Did not mean to have that summoned. Cause, uh... Yeah, it, it does pointer damage, but not contact. And that's, that's those exact reasons. That's why it's not like I lost this challenge run. I just, you know, if it maintained the direction I was facing and I wouldn't have to worry about it, but it always reverts or tries to revert back to. Uh, yeah, it wackles a lot. No, I mean, like, it reverts to facing downwards when yeah. you stop. Uh, well, sorry, if I'm standing still, it always, whoops, uh, reverts to aiming downwards. Yeah. Yeah, this, this is how you do it. You get the finger. I'll oh, get back here. Didn't mean to eat you. There we go. Yeah. I actually kind of like this position more, just because I don't have to ha use any brain power. Yeah. Uh, worrying about it. Pick this up. Poor, yeah. poor bony heart. Uh, maybe the strategy with her is just to screw the claws and intentionally go with her little, uh... Stabby thing. Well, you can't have life. spirit hearts for it. Right, but... So I don't know. I mean, just... Because, yeah, I mean, you're playing at half-heart regardless. Just instead of the clots 
firing weak low tier rate stuff. It's you're stabbing things. Oh, I would I would rather have the clots fire for me. I mean, they're cute, but well, I I, I don't like the uh, inconsistency of it. I mean, it's kind of like playing Jacob and Esau. Just instead of one idiot, you've got fifty little ones. Yeah, but those, those don't affect my movement. That's that's. I don't even care that there are two characters. Like, give me Jacob and Esau and just cut my damage in half. I'm fine. I don't care. Just a permanent damage cut in half, no matter what. But don't. But have uh, Esau never take damage. I'll take it a hundred. Cut my damage down by. I was gonna say a tenth. That's literally less. Make my damage a tenth of what it is. Just don't make me deal with that. I'll take it every day. Was there anything good in here? Not really. No. It was a battery, I guess, but you know, anything for it, so. And someone right? Yeah, good, I did. Now, get back here. Get back here! I'm not trying to cheat the system! Well, no, you can't. Alright, well, that guy's dead, so this should be done. Alright, what you got? Um, Ooh. That'll literally kill you. Yeah, I almost took it. I forgot you can't sit at zero health. Uh, money equals power is bad. Uh, it's In this yeah, run. If, if because you get strong enough and just stop buying stuff, it can pay off, but I wouldn't take it this early necessarily. Yeah. So, so it's not that it's actually bad, but in my current stance, it's pretty bad. Because yeah, I'm, I'm just going to take unnecessary damage. And Finger's also good for putting out fires, I guess. Stop. In the name of love. Nice. Right. Yeah. I honestly, I'm just trying not to spawn. That is the hardest thing about this, is just making them not spawn. You see my point, right? No, 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 like, I mean, here, I'll do it with spawning if, if you want to. No, we'll do that next episode. We'll have Oni here for a couple episodes. Sure, what's in here? Thanks. Appreciate it, I guess. Hey, there is an unlock you can get for sleeping in bed, so I don't know if that counts, but it should. If you sleep in enough of them, it pops an item. Thank you. Wow. Can I? Oh, no, it's it's the wrong one. Well, that was silly. Yeah, I, I literally just, like, accidentally bumped into him. I really should have gotten really? rid of that. Well, if nothing else, when you get down to low health, you'll also get flight. So. Yeah. That's that's something to take away from it. I wonder how soy milk would work. I don't I don't remember if a or um, faster tier rate makes you spawn the guys more. Yeah, I don't know. You can't get soy milk in the silver, right? So I've never tried that. Oh, you can't? No, I think you can get it in the gold one, but not in the silver one. They have different pools. Tactical death! Yes, I'm specifically not attacking these guys to make sure I don't walk into that. Hit him. And I think one more wave. I think that's all that I have left. Now! Yeah! Kill him. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Alright. Alright. So we definitely don't have enough money, but we have enough to check the sh item room. 
That's something. <laughs> I already checked. What? You already checked the shop. Yeah. You can check it again, but... I don't remember what's in there. That's fair. I sometimes forget to... If I'm if I don't have the money and there wasn't something like truly stellar, no yeah. clue what was in there. Yeah, and I walk back in and I'll ride this jump. Yeah, there was nothing stellar. Yeah, the the slot's useless. The key's pretty useless. This is meh. Yeah. That's... Oh wait, I need the. Yaki yaki. Yo, let's go. Wait, that's not the one I thought it was, so well. Yeah, sad on you would probably be better. It's not bad, but... More AIDS poop. Do you Good. take damage to that? To what? The spike in the floor. No. <clears throat> Might be able to get a little, uh ghost guy there to brim the poop for you. Whoop. Crap. Fancy feet. Alright. <laughs> Good one dead. Oh, come on. That was not lined up. He scooted. Yeah. Can you fit through there? <gasps> you can! <laughs> Ninja poop. Nope. Nope. Also... Like, the other greedier mode runs I did did not have these hard of enemies as the bosses, which is really weird. Yeah. Like, especially consistently getting them. Yeah. It wasn't even, like, a one-off thing. Does this fill me up fully? It does. Yeah, I guess they don't go away. Huh. We'll clear out the bottom room. I mean, I don't know why, but I like clearing out this bottom room just to. I don't, because I almost always clear it out, and then I'm like, "All right, time to go by." Yeah. But, all right. You know, you might you might find an item or you know, penny or something in here, and then it's it's good to know just to have it cleared and get some free information. All right, so we need to skip the devil room. Devil room is bad. No, you don't want devils. Mm. When I'm at very limited health, I do not want to deal with the devil. It's oh, three come hearts. on. Oh, uh, yeah. Like I said, very little health. That's not <laughs> little health. Ah, mon frere. You are so wrong. In a challenge, uh, 12 health is little health. Okay, I, I would go in there if I had, like, five hearts. I don't want to go in there and go back down to one heart. Well, that worked out. Um, there's a heart here. Oh, there it is. <clears throat> yeah. It's the perfect price. Well, the perfect price is free, but... If, it, if, if I have to pay for it, it's the perfect price. All right, now give me my angel room. <gasps> the box! Eh? Now you get to the top room for free. So that nice. effectively saved you five cents, gave you a little bit of range. Yay! Well, that's fun. I don't know I don't if it's good, super... but I like yeah. it. Yeah. Probably not great, but... Yeah. Sorry, let me word it this way. Literally nothing. Let me word it this way. Hey! I don't care if it's good. I mean, it's a challenge run. I, I wouldn't care in a normal run, maybe, but... Um, uh, definitely want that. Kinda want to open that. I feel like they nerfed the, uh, <laughs> curse rooms. 
They don't pay out with items a lot in greed mode, it seems like. But you can find some rims in there, or a bunch of blue hearts. You can still, still find some good stuff. Not the corn poops. No corny poops. Corny poops. I see the beauty between you and I. Corny poops. It's part of a balanced breakfast. It's part of a ba It's the result of a balanced breakfast. Corny poops. <laughs> You're eating corn for breakfast. You don't. It's called cornbread. Corn flakes, maybe, but... It's very concerning when you figure out just how bad all foods are for you. Yeah. We watched a, uh, basically like a documentary thing. Uh, not too, too long ago. And it was talking about how, like, food scientists are evil people. Ah! <laughs> Wall spooters. Uh, because they literally are paid to uh, figure out the best way to manipulate people. <clears throat> uh, to, to keep eating. Yep. I know I haven't, like, attacked you and stuff, but I'm very disappointed that you're still alive. <sighs> you know what's a top tier trinket here? Bloody penny. Uh, Any penny. Well, I was going to say Blessed Penny, but yeah, I guess in this case, Bloody would probably be better, because it pays out more frequently. Or it feels like it, at least. I don't know if it actually has better odds, but... Uh, yeah, I had Burnt Penny, and that worked out decently well before I screwed up, but... Mm. If nothing else, you can get a lot of consumables that way. <clears throat> Damn. And the run's over. Oops. Yep. Oh, yep. oh, well. The whole point of this is not to... Okay, I don't like not knowing. <clears throat> I'll restart for that. <laughs> Alright, well, I have a lot of speed. Lots of speed up, pill. <laughs> Just on a pedestal. Yep. <gasps> Deep pockets is the best item. Yeah. <laughs> Anything good? That's the one based off enemies. That's literal garbage. Spooners. Yeah, like, I don't know. I hate that she uses it as a weapon because it's like... All right, congratulations. Now you have to fight from close range. Uh, you can shoot it. All right. It just well, it, it's, slow. it's slower than quad brimstone. It feels like it. Uh, it's, I mean, that's just her naturally garbage tier, right? I mean. Mm. Yeah, she's telling zoom into enemies. You go faster when you make car noises. That is a fact. Yeah, I don't know. Well, I'll try another run as her using, you know, her entire gimmick. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see which one... Yeah. Works better. Yeah, you well, we're not over yet. Let's I, I, I actually forgot. I thought this despawned everything. Nope. Okay, it just so stops that's... future waves from spawning. Yeah, I couldn't remember. It's a pause button, not a murder enemy button. Thanks. <laughs> might, as well, might as well poop it. Nope. Pop the poop. Because I'm going to be tempted to go over there and use it. It could be nothing. Alright, fine. 
See? Now, now we know. It's nothing. Amnesia? How will you ever find your way around this massive floor? What was this one again? Yeah. Oh yeah, it was bread. I don't remember how much bread heals. I don't know. What a horrible night to get some cool horns. Yeah, I mean, like... That's always the thing that, like, bums me out, is, like, I really like the design. Oh, yeah. The horns are great. Um, but just... This weapon is butts. Honestly, I, don't want... I think it's better than our stupid clots. No, clots are much better. Like, on a normal run. I, I get greed mode yeah. because there's just a billion enemies that spawn. Yeah, but, I mean, literally, one of the runs I had earlier, it was just an enemy spawn between me and, like, half my clots, and so I I back away from the enemy, and the clots just stop because they're stuck on the enemy, and they just die. And it's like, all right, well, see you later, clots. I guess that was fun while it lasted. But, I mean, like, it's, right. I don't know. I figured that was worth the gamble, because this might be the last one I do for this episode. Not exactly sure. Oh, you know what would be really good? Oh no. Playing the Tainted Keeper? Uh, no, I actually really don't like the Tainted Keeper. Why not? I, I, think um, I love it. I constantly... Alright, I'm, I'm super out of focus, so... Let's just go down and use this. Uh, yeah, I, I couldn't remember how I wanted to say it. Um, I hate the, uh, constant desire for greed, and I hate always being one heart away from death. Alright, well, uh, don't play Maggie, then. <laughs> Why is she always... Uh, a take what the greed does with money, and she does basically the exact same thing with hearts. Is this 2 HP? It is 2 HP. Yeah. I shouldn't have picked that up yet, though. So, yeah, if you don't like the Tainted Keeper, honestly, I think Maggie is worse than him in greed mode and, like, roughly equal to him in normal mode. I, I don't know. I, I just like the Keeper much better. So Maggie is only allowed two heart containers she can kind never get of. more health because if she she has two regular heart containers and if you have birthright uh three but she can take normal health ups and get extra containers sort of but they bleed out and leave like a creep on the ground or whatever so you can't like keep them filled they're, they're constantly running oh yeah, that's super and annoying. So, and so, like, the idea is when you run into people and take, like, a half heart of damage, if it kills them, it'll spawn a bunch of hearts mm -hmm. so you can, like, refill them. But they despawn, like, the pennies he generates. So you're constantly fighting to keep the health up. And I mean, I, I beat Mega Satan Weather, so it's possible. It's not that hard, but it's little tedious and I found it to be less fun than the keeper like I don't know I just like him better yeah I mean like he's not the worst but there's a lot of mullabooms yes it is was yes it was yeah that's a good thing about mullabooms if you can safely blow up one of them it just clears out most of the way but they can be kind of irritating yeah. Until then. Especially if you're the lost and you're trying to like hide on rocks and stuff. Cause... Yeah. It's one of those things where it's like, is it actually bad versus do I enjoy it? I don't really enjoy yeah. like that constant pressure of you're literally losing like all of your value if you're not um, keeping up on yeah, it. Yeah, so that's... That's kind of one of the things I didn't like about Maggie was you don't have time to stop and think, do I want to backtrack to the arcade or something like that? Do I want to 
the secret room because the longer you take, you're just bleeding health, whether you're doing anything or not. Even those you, two, do two not bleed though? Right, the two, the two that you do not, they're regular hearts. And three with birthright, but. All right, new yeah. strategy. So you, you can't bleed to death at least, but it, it's still like, you know, you're, you're always right at do death's door if you take a yeah. lot of time faffing about, and I mean, you know how I am, so. Yeah. Because uh, I'm convinced I only beat Mega Satan because I had a sun card I took with me and popped it right before starting his fight, basically. Yeah. Because that will fill up all of your hearts. And so you can kind of like start. So she can them. get up to 12, but they're right. bleeding containers. Yeah, the other 10 are always going to be bleeding out. <laughs> 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 what? Cuba meets. <laughs> uh, so um, I don't remember. Do do these spawn every single floor? Like yeah. actual? Um, you don't have a regular secret room, and you'll always have a super secret room, effectively. I literally, I think it was one of the runs, I had these, and I yeah. went to every single room, and there was nothing. Right, but the thing is, it can spawn in the curse room as well. I went to the curse was. room, and it wasn't there. No, I'm pretty sure you didn't. Because it, it should be able to spawn on the left side of the shop or curse room or exit room, or on the right side of one of the item rooms. But it should be in one of those five locations. Sure. If I remember correctly, this item's Garbo. Um, I mean, it kind of chucks the enemy, so I mean, it's not the worst, but for uh, greed mode at least, because you can charge it pretty easily, and it'll draw in big waves of stuff. So I wouldn't call it great, but it's also not worth passing up on. So like, just throw it in the middle of the room there. You know. That'll kill the little guys at least. And well, I thought it was. I thought it was the one that um, all it does is pull them in together. That's what I was initially thinking. Cause I think there's one of them that just, or maybe it's a tear effect. It just magnetizes them, and then they just sit near you. Oh uh, yeah. And that one is hot garbo. Yeah. Um, Binky's tier is up, right? Yes. And a blue heart. Okay. And a size down. I suppose I'll go here first, even though it's not worth it. Well, not if you take that. I feel like 90% of the time there's just nothing in here. Yeah, you probably. It's not a lot. But every once in a while you find a pain in a fire or something and just... You know, it's nice to know. Alright. Tears up. Aww. Damage up. And a bone heart. How do bone hearts work again? Do they go before? They, yeah, they go at the end no matter what. You get the battery on the right side for your thingy. Oh, yeah. So many of these haven't had a uh, spacebar <laughs> item. Right. What's more valuable, a key for the next floor or maintaining the bone heart? Um, a key for the yeah. next floor and taking the bone heart after the boss. No, not more poop! I mean... What? I don't know what that was, but... What? Why did you break? It didn't even kill a spider. Yeah, I don't know. 
But yeah, if you're not gonna buy the heart, then you might as well wait until the next floor because the key might be on sale there. Take you two cents. Yeah. Because you're guaranteed to always have one key in the shop at least. Kind of irritating when another slot has a key too. I'm like, what? But, uh. No spider! Nice. I just said no spider. And Poop said lots of spider. So, you know. No spider. So, who's gonna win that one? Probably you eventually, but... Yeah. Depends on... Okay. Oh, wait. I guess it's because he curved because he pooped and dashed. Uh, which is incredibly frustrating, but... Yeah, like right oh. there. I didn't know he could do that. So, I don't know. Sometimes they... Jay all in your shape, no man. But don't have that. No spider. No. Oh my spider. No spider. And chocolate milk poop. <sighs> Why exactly does the whistle? I don't know. So is that something Eggman's poop does that we don't know about? Probably. Um, with this much health, it's probably worth going. Yo, Guppy! I mean, two black hearts. Hi, poop. It's, it's, it's good, but Not you're Guppy. leaving a mediocre item for a for top tier item. I mean, it's just pretty good, but I don't know. I don't know if it's worth a heart when you're never going to find the other two pieces. Uh, I mean, I can use it every single wave. Yeah. It's basically guaranteed to kill two enemies. <sighs> I think it's worth it. Hungry eyes. I hate the fact that, like, now 42 minutes in, it's like, all right, it's progress time. Yeah. Oh, cool, more tears. Alright. So, and that, that's the thing with grade mode. Like, once you finally get a run going, it's not too bad. But that first wave is just so awful. It's hard to get the harder characters off the ground. What? That's so weird. I could have sworn it filled up the, the bone heart first. Oh, well, I guess I was wrong. Nope. Oh. Now there's another half heart. Got a knife, that's fun. Um, I don't like any of these. Maybe the knife, but... You have to charge yeah, the knife. I, I kind of get why you wouldn't want that, but... I'd probably take it. But yeah, if you don't like the knife... Then well, no, 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 I like the knife, but we're we're specifically avoiding right, using well, in them, this so... situation, yeah. Then this isn't... Yeah. Damn. I, I like anything? how it blew up the spooter one, but not the knife one. Or the, the nickel one. Nope, didn't get anything. Oh well, yeah. it was worth trying. Can it get the reroll machine or the... I know, right? Or like, the what the heck? Yeah, that's the problem with that book and Curse of the Tower and whatever. So many times in the bigger rooms, it just misses everything. And it's kind of risky in a smaller room. Oh god, we have the cam camouflaged one. Is he dead? I think he died. Yeah, I think he blew up. If I had to choose between the two, I would rather take this item, because one, I ooh, could get the guppy pieces, and two, I also just like the guppy items more. And it also can be used constantly, so I won't accidentally yeah. miss a wave. Like, miss the important wave. Right. Yeah, I mean, that's something to be said for an item. You can just pop off and you don't have to worry about that maxing charges and whatever. Yeah. Because D6 in greed mode is technically good, because you can just reroll so many items in the shop and whatever, but it's kind of irritating. Mm-hmm. 
you either have to try to help to stop the wave or wait a bunch of charges, and it's. Eh. Whereas this, you just oh, new wave, hit spacebar. Yes. I don't like that. Nice and easy. Yeah. Nice just admit, that's that's why I was saying, uh, yeah, hundred percent. I'm gonna take it because it just it's very simple to use, and it's very effective. It's not like um the toot. Where, like, you have to worry about your placement and its effect is probably less than a fly? Yeah. Like, at peak usage, it's it's just worse than a normal fly. So... I mean, you could theoretically poison a lot of stuff, but, I mean, yeah. It's really hard to get good use out of it, for sure. Yeah, and you have to put yourself in danger. Alright. Again, he does have his own song. Sound of Mr. Two. Legendary music, man. Yeah, the, the knife is gonna mess me up too much. So I do not think it's worth taking. I think it's worth preserving the bone heart, though. Yeah, not the worst idea. No more poops! Yeah, what's with the poops this run? Although this is the regular poop and not the red one, so... Might actually be easier than the last bonus. Oh, 100%. Yeah, but... Oops. Really? He tagged me twice? That's super annoying. I think he bought the heart. Yeah. I mean, like, it's still likely I lose it, but at least I pro also protected the Necro hearts. Yeah. Oh, I... I am upset. Oh, well. Oops, are dangerous in this. Uh, well, I didn't think you would bounce that far. Well, that too, but I mean, just, just in general. Yeah, literally the worst enemies to fight are yeah. is anything that can spawn. Yeah. I feel like every single enemy should have a spawn limit. No, it, it can get pretty silly, because that was the problem people had with the portals. And... They ended up, like, nerfing the portals, and now you can only find them in the delirium floor, or, like, those really, like, crappy portals in the, uh, Gehenna or whatever. Yeah. Well, so what they did is, literally, a portal can only spawn for our, uh, so, for argument's sake. I don't know the exact number, but they can only spawn two to seven enemies, and then it, it just destroys itself. That's a good balance, because yeah. if you kill it early, it doesn't get seven spawns. That's the maximum it can spawn. Yep. Ooh, nickel. Nice. That's hype, boo. Yoink. But, uh, yeah, you know, enemies that split into other enemies or spawn a bunch of stuff are terrible. Also pretty bad are the hosts, just because they take forever to pop up sometimes, and you literally can't even clear out a wave, no matter how much damage you do, mm -hmm. before something else is up. So they just... Or those stupid brimstone ghosts, I hate those in greed mode. Yeah, just because they don't you just sh up here. Yeah. Yeah, you just end up waiting for them to respawn, and it's like, come on, jerk. Show yourself so that I might smite you. Well, all you have to do is target uh, the, the boss enemy first. Okay, well, I mean, like, I get that. But just give him a limit. Like, he can only spawn 10, 20. Well, I don't care what the limit is. Oh, we can only spawn 200 million. Okay, now you're just being a dumbass. Yeah. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Boy, oh, boy. I'm still not going to take the knife. The, yeah, the, the without spawning a bunch of them, my strongest asset is distance. Yeah. Hey, teeny tiny one. Nice. Didn't check the end row. <laughs> yeah, specifically didn't. But it could have been something good. Man. Could also uh, been crap. It almost certainly is, but you're gonna have to do it anyway, so. Yeah, so why don't we do it when it's uh, time? Cause like even if it had ten, okay, well that's that's an absorbent amount of money, so that's. Uh, 
That's its own fallacy. I was about to say, even it had ten dimes in it. Okay, then I could just, you know, buy garbage shit and have it sit on the floor. Yeah. Oh, I guess they died. I was specifically not firing at them because I wanted to, oops, make sure I took care of the other, uh... Yeah. Oh, it probably died over a pit. Because then they just die. So this died yeah. over a pit. Got a lot of entrails on the floor for this one. Yeah, all the gloop. Um, now do I want to deal with the angel now? I'm very low on health. Yes, I want to deal with the angel. Well, you can't. You took a double deal. Well, I don't have enough health. Well, there's no reason not to look. You could have been black hearts in there. Yeah, I forgot. I don't know. I feel like if you skip one, it should be like, alright, angel deals are back on the table. Uh, destroy stuff. That's okay. You can look for the secret room. Oh, Which, that is true. I mean, that's not that bad. <sighs> Ooh, a penny. Nope. No, I can't. It has to be on the right side. It can't be down there. Because it, it's a super secret room, so it has to be, like, off of a room. And you can only have the one entrance. Hungry eyes. Da, 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 da. One up is okay. Yeah, I'd say it can't be on the left side because spikes. Which means it's in your exit room or your curse room. Nice. Yeah, so it's probably in your exit room, but you can destroy the skulls at least. Yeah, probably not worth it. Yep, exactly what I thought. Their payout yeah, value is so low. You should always get a black card or a card, so... Mm. But, yeah. It's... Let's see. Is the gonna... 1-Up worth it? No. Uh, not for me, but, yeah. I don't know. It's absolutely not worth it. It's worse thing to take. Which is why I'm going to take it. Ooh, is this the suicide. repeat of floor? <laughs> no, that's the, the red one, Suicide Pill. I never remember. Yeah, that's plan C, so you basically give yourself an abortion. Because uh, it's it's based on the uh, plan B, the day after abortion pill stuff. Oops. I should have stayed down. So, uh, yeah. If you want to have worse suicide gang, go for it. I thought it was better. Well. Well, suicide, suicide gang gives you ton of items. That one kills everything in the room, including yourself, so... Right, but it gives you 15 seconds to leave. It kills right, everything and then gives you 15 seconds, so... Right, but you still die even if okay. you leave the room, unless it you can, like, enter a chest. It literally stuck me to the enemy. That was frustrating. Okay. I, I could not avoid the enemy. And you didn't even get 15 cents. Not that there's a good item to buy anyway, but... Uh, kind of just kind of annoying you were only at port. Why am I not getting my charges? Well, you've already done this. Then don't spawn them again. No, Alright, that that, that's a bug right. that needs to be fixed. Yeah, I don't know why it would, I don't know why it would work like that. Because, yeah, bug or not, that's kind of dumb. Hmm. Yeah, these little shield guys are kind of okay. Well, then you would always just, what, die? Yeah, no, no, no. Like, oh, yeah, that's a good strategy. Because when you die, you don't get uh, a lot of uh, resources. Well, that'll help. Oh, my God. Yeah. I got I got too frazzled because the game bugged. Uh, no, it didn't. It's intended that way. Bullshit. That's that's a bug or an idiot. Really? Yeah, I don't, I don't really care if it's a bug or not. It's pretty Whatever. Dumb. I'm done. I'm tired of the bug. 
All right. Well, yeah. there we go. There's the challenge. Now we're going to do it the other way. <sighs> so thank you very much for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.